Okay, I'm going to do my first unboxing of uh, Death uh, uh, Lord's uh, Morgas. I'm going to open them and I'm going to build them. I'm going to show different snippets and then I'm going to put it on YouTube so you all you can enjoy. Okay, this is what comes in the box of the Morgas. Uh, you get the directions. You get three different sprues with all the different parts you need to build. Uh, today we're going to be uh, building the uh, um, Archilles, or however you say that cool word, um, just because they get, oh, they get more reach and early snaz and it's on the build. These ones are cute if you want to summon. They get the extra dice on the charge, but we're not going to fool with those. I'm going to build a standing army with a bunch of these bad, mad, bad men. So, so anyways... Uh, you get Wicked Directions. These are the new uh, type of directions. See, they actually say Age of Sigmar on them. That means they're new school. A um, bunch of the cool weapons, all numbered. And then you get uh, this uh, Wicked, uh, two other sprues. And then round bases. Gone are the square bases. Oh no, just round bases. What if I want to play fantasy with these? And not Age of Sigmar. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, well, well, we'll keep it this a rolling. I'm going to take these all off the sprue. Or maybe I'll follow the directions on this first one because I've got a bunch to build. So, anyways, I'll be right back. Well, magically, we're right there. It's a little fiddly with the directions, but they fit together really well. It just takes a little manipulating. Especially when you're putting these parts together. They go one certain way though. But, so these parts here are pretty tricky. Kind of how these, this piece was hard to get exactly. You just kind of got to work it around and it'll fit in there. And just use a little bit of the plastic glue when you begin and it kind of will. So you can move them around a little bit to get them to sit in there. So, anyways, got this far. Ready for action. This is gonna be so awesome. Alright, stay tuned. Well, I made it this far. I got the main body, and you attach the wings, legs, head, helmet, and then you can attach it to the base. Ta da! So, so I want to give you a quick update on the progress of. These awesome more guests. Well, getting these wings to stand straight and to get them put on a um, base is kind of fiddly. And that's kind of an understatement, the word fiddly. But I had to bust, put away the plastic glue and bust out some of this uh, Gorilla Glue to make it a little less un no, fiddly. Um, plastic glue is just too much. So anyway. Put some Gorilla Glue on it, got them to straighten out a little better, to position them how I wanted it to the, so it will fly straight when you put them on the base. I'll tune in later. Alright, drum roll please. Well, there it is, it's fully assembled. I only have uh, five more to build and then to the painting, so. I'll be back. See, as you can see, I always um, take all the mold lines off, cut out everything, and then I put them in these uh, little, little trays so I can just put them together. So some of the hardest things to do is to get all these mold lines off some of these detailed parts. So you just have to go over them with your tool and usually kind of go through them piece by piece and work, up, work off all the little mold lines and all the connection points to the sprue and all that. But in the finished product usually is a pretty good deal. Put a little extra time in to get them cleaned up nice. So after you get them all assembled, then you need to prime them. I'm using a Army Painter Primer Matte to White. So you just go over them nice and easy, evenly, use a lot of coats.
Keep rinse and repeat till they're nicely evenly covered. Well, and there it is. Get some green wash over them. A little tan shade over the top of base from matte white. Very pink. Here's the first step. Well, there's the first uh, set of them, the six of the Morgan's Archi. Archi. Real simple, just primed with uh, the uh, base primer matte white army painter and uh, smear on the good old uh, BL tan green shade, green null oil basically. Smear that on there and that's uh, basically the effect you uh, end up with. I'm going to go over these, with, do a little white uh, dry brush over these and do some basing and call it a wrap. And then here's the matte white. I do the dry brushing. Hitting all the the raised portions and it creates that nice uh, contrast. And then after that, put a little bit of snow down. Then I'm gonna add some grass, leadership grass to the bottom. Dry brushing, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And there you have it. So basically you start out with a white um, primer and paint. Then you go over that with some green wash. And then you dry brush it. And then I use the Blizzard Technical Paint for the bases. And then I added some tundra grass and uh, put some black around the bases. And there you have it. More gassed Archies. These are the Archies. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoy this uh, tutorial and I'd um, love to see your comments, feedback, anything like that. And hopefully you look forward to some more videos. Uh, just kind of from the layperson trying to get into the hobby and um, enjoy Age of Sigmar. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day. Bum chicka wow wow. Bum chicka wow wow. Bum chicka wow wow.